Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're in Quebec again, and once again, we're at the company called Le Vel Tendre. In a previous video, I showed you guys another one of their chalets that was much larger. This is a much smaller version. It's a really, it's called a zoo box. It's like a really tiny house. It's really neat. It's kind of like glamping. I can't wait to show it to you. So without further ado, let's hop into it. This company has a great location located in some hills about an hour from Montreal. And this cabin specifically is located at the top of this hill looking out onto some really amazing views. Heading inside, the doors are sliding glass and they open fully, which is really great. And as you can see, this tiny home has everything visible to you. It's completely open, there's no rooms or anything like that. But surprisingly, there's actually a few beds and then a full bathroom in here as well. The main bed is actually located above you, which is pretty neat. When you want to sleep, you just untie the knot and then pull the bed down to yourself. It does take some force, so it's comforting to know that the bed won't fall on your head. Uh, it is held there by a counterweight on the other side. It's a really comfortable bed and it gives you some amazing views when you're laying there of the outside. And then there's also some other sleeping areas near the ceiling, which is pretty neat. One of the best parts, in my opinion, is the fireplace, which heats the entire tiny house very well, but it also looks really nice. And they provide unlimited firewood and kindling for you. Beside the fireplace is actually a really neat rock climbing wall and it has a harness and a thing on top to make sure you're safe as well. And then there's a stationary bike which can help um, give electricity as well as the solar panels to the entire unit. It does have a pretty full kitchen with everything you can need to cook, but one thing to keep in mind is it does have a pretty small fridge and then it's gas powered as well. But in terms of utensils and salt, pepper, olive oil, all that sort of stuff and cutlery, they have everything provided too, which is pretty great. And one of the best parts, though we didn't do it this time we stayed, is the bathtub which can wheel around the place so it's perfect if you want to fill it up with hot water and then move it into the main area and then open the doors and windows and relax by the fireplace, it's pretty great. But this time we didn't use it and the reason is because we wanted to check out the spa only 15 minutes away and it really didn't disappoint. It was amazing for the price and we highly recommend it. The spa also had a polar dip into the river which was sadly frozen over at this time um, you're not supposed to have a phone in there so i couldn't get a lot of footage but it was really great it was beautiful and we highly recommend it okay guys that concludes this video as always thank you so much for watching if you want to stay here all the links and information are going to be in the description below thank you again for watching and i look forward to seeing you in the next video